On planet Vegeta, the lone voice of a crying baby rings out. Kakarot. Here he is. So this is Bardock's kid, huh? Yeah. Clearly the son of a low-class warrior. His stats are ridiculously low. No doubt, he'll be sent off to some remote backwater planet. Yeah, you may be right. His power may be low, but his voice sure isn't. By the way, do you happen to know where Bardock is? Hmm. Oh, he's probably already off on some mission. He's been gone for a while at this point. I would imagine he's wrapping things up right about now. So, this is the target, huh? You guys ready to get started? <laughs> it's time to have some fun then. Let's do this! Bunch of little worms. About 400 clicks west. You're mine. And so the inhabitants of the planet were completely wiped out. A typical job for the Saiyans who would conquer planets and prepare them for sale under the orders of Emperor Frieza. However, little did the Saiyan warriors know that they too would soon meet with a terrible fate. One man, Goku's father, Bardock, fought to resist that fate. This is his story.
He caught me off guard. Hear me? Just now, I've hit you with my fabled future punch technique. You should now see that you and your kind are doomed. Future punch? What the hell are you talking about? There is nothing, nothing but annihilation in your future. You will all be wiped out. Just like what happened to us. How does it feel knowing the future? Knowing that your days are numbered. <laughs> That's enough! Heh. <laughs> what a joke. The Saiyan race is unbeatable. That guy honestly thought we'd suffer? Give me a break. Hey, Bardock. Bardock! Hey, Bardock! Snap out of it! Bardock! The hell's wrong with you? What are you doing? Bardock! So, how's he doing? Well, physically speaking, he's completely healthy. But his brainwaves are another matter. Nothing we can do about it. I guess Bardock's gonna have to sit this one out. W what? What happened to me? What the hell's going on? There is nothing, nothing but annihilation in your future. You will all be wiped out, just like what happened to us. How does it feel knowing the future? Knowing that your days are numbered? <laughs> <laughs> Bardock! You've awakened! Hold on, I'll open the capsule for you. What the hell was that just now? do this to you? No. We wiped out all those bastards, no problem. Well then, who the hell did this? It was Frieza. He stabbed every one of us in the back. <coughs> no, he wouldn't. Just as we were about to return to planet Vegeta, the... <coughs> the cowards attacked us. Obviously, we, we didn't go down without a fight. But... <coughs> Vasha, then Shugesh, got taken out. Then they got Borgos. <coughs> Why? Tell me! Why'd you do this? <laughs> you Saiyans really don't know when to die, do ya? <sighs> D D Doria. All right then. Guess I'll just toy with you a little bit longer. But why? Why are you guys doing this? You really want to know? Fine by me. 
seeing as you're already as good as dead. <laughs> We're doing this because Lord Frieza ordered us to. What? Lord Frieza said you Saiyans are starting to be a problem for him. You're lying. We've faithfully served Lord Frieza for such a long time. We've done everything he's ordered. And this is what happens if he decides he doesn't like you. So, so this is the thanks we get for all of our heart. <coughs> Hard work? Heh. <laughs> Basically, it is! <laughs> the. That bastard Frieza. He was just using us the whole time. <laughs> I. I don't have much left in me. Uh, at this rate, Freeze is gonna wipe out all the Saiyans. <coughs> Listen to me, Bardock. You need to go back to Planet Vegeta. You gotta rally the troops and take Freezer out. <coughs> Show him what we Saiyans can... can really do. <laughs> you bastards. Looks like now it's your turn to die. he is. He's still just a Saiyan. Stay focused. Here goes. Huh. Kaioken! What's wrong, Kakarot? Surely that's not your best. Not again. Damn it. What the hell am I seeing right now? Now die! Don't toy with us! You're going to die just like the other Saiyan trash! Trash. Holy trash, here is you! Well, that 
didn't last long. I wanted to play with him a little bit longer. Dodoria, time to head back. Huh? Rendezvous with us right away. We're headed to planet Vegeta. I got it. <laughs> Damn it! Lord Frieza, he actually betrayed us! <laughs> it has been quite some time since I've last seen a good light show. I'm hoping for a splendid display of fireworks. That... that's Lord Frieza's spaceship! No, he's... he's headed toward planet Vegeta, damn it! Wait. Huh? K Kakarot. I won't let it happen! <clears throat> it's me. It's gonna be me! Future, I'm gonna change it. <laughs> this will be the last time I gaze upon this planet. L Lord Frieza. A piece of Dodoria. What do you want? Can't you see that I'm a little bit busy right now? Stand down at once. Lord Freezer wishes to engage. L Lord Freezer? Be quick about it. Unless you want to die. D Damn it! He's running away. The hell? Huh? Lord Frieza! Lord Frieza! Lord Frieza! <laughs> Lord Frieza? What? What's the... going on? Frieza! So you finally show your damn face! 
I must commend you on your efforts thus far. Although I had originally planned on simply reducing you and your pathetic little planet to smoldering atoms. Hmm. You've managed to impress me. It would be a shame for such bravery to go unrewarded. I, Emperor Frieza, will graciously engage you in combat. Consider this a parting gift from me to you. Arrogant bastard! Now then, when you're ready. <laughs> it looks like playtime is now over. So why don't you go and join your brethren in death? is it. This will change everything. The fate of planet Vegeta. My own fate. The fate of Kakarot also. Your fate as well! <laughs> this ends now! <laughs> What the? Farewell, foolish Saiyan.
Kakarot. It's all up to you now. Avenge us. Avenge the Saiyans and planet Vegeta! you come from? Huh? Oh my, look at that! You have a tail! Ho oh, ho ho! Well, this is no place for a child like you, is it? Would you like to come stay with me? Oh, ho, ho, ho. You're a sprightly little one, aren't you? What do you say to becoming old Son Gohan's new grandson? Sound good? You're gonna need a name. Let's see, uh... Hmm... Goku! You'll be Son Goku! I'll make sure you grow up nice and strong. Upsie daisy! <laughs> Upsie daisy! Upsie daisy! <laughs> Upsie daisy! <laughs> <laughs> and thus began the epic tale we know today as Dragon Ball. Prince Vegeta of Planet Vegeta. His exceptional power level has earned him the respect of not only his fellow Saiyans, but also that of the Frieza Force. However, Little does he know what fate has in store for him. This is the beginning of that story, one part of a larger tale. Nappa, status report. Oh, all right. I'm still fighting, but I've wiped out about 80% of them. Got it. Give them hell to their bitter end. I'm almost done here. You got it! Now die. That's all of them. Guess it's time to report back to Prince Vegeta. Huh? A message from the Frieza Force? That's new. Never been contacted by them before. Nappa here. Yeah, of course I can hear you. Uh, Prince Vegeta, can you hear me? What is it? I just got a transmission from Lord Frieza. He said, somehow Planet Vegeta's just vanished without a trace. Oh, and what? I guess it was taken out by a giant meteor or something. I can't believe it. Only a few Saiyans are left, including us. Huh, and what? Oh, oh uh, well, that was it. This planet's about done for, too. I need to ask Lord Frieza for another to conquer. One more challenging. The true reason for Planet Vegeta's destruction would remain unknown for some time. Though Vegeta had his own unvoiced suspicions, he would continue to seek more power and commit himself to a life of fighting. Eventually, his path would come to odds with two others. Frieza, the evil tyrant, and Kakarot, the low-class warrior raised on Earth. <laughs> 